Right, so question three says the scatter graph shows some information about 10 cars of the same type and make. It says the graph shows the age in years and the value in pounds of each car. We're also told that the table shows the age and value of two other cars of the same type and make. And part A says on the scatter graph, plot the information from the table. So just like plot, plotting coordinates here, we should all get this mark. Just be really careful. We're going to go to one year and plot that against 800 or uh, 8,200 pounds. So one year, 8,000, that's 9,000 right there. So if anywhere is going to go wrong, it's going to go wrong in your scale. That means each of the lines is worth 200. So 8,200 is there. So we've got to plot that. Second one, 3.5 years and 5,000 pounds. 3.5 years is right in here, 3.5. And we want 5,000 pounds is going to be, what if that's 4,000, that's 6,000. That must be 5,000 right there. So we go up and across to there. Okay, lovely. So make sure you get that mark. Second part, it says describe the relationship between the age and the value of the cars. Now, relationship means that we've got to describe it in the context of the question. It didn't ask for the type of correlation, it asked for the relationship. So what can I see? What is the diagram scatter, or what is the scatter graph suggesting? If I look at it as the age increases, the value decreases, and that makes sense. Cars lose their value with time. So we'll say as, the age increases so as the age goes up the value decreases and that should get us the mark there part c it says a car of the same type and make is two and a half years old it says estimate the value of the car now, if you're dealing with a scatter diagram and you see the word estimate, you need to know that you should always draw a line of best fit to at least ensure that you get one mark. So I'm going to draw a line of best fit here. So I'm going to try and make sure that we've pretty much got the same number of dots both sides of the line. And now we need to make an estimate from that two and a half years old. So we're going to go to two and a half, 2.5, we're going to read up, let's change that, we're going to read up and then we're going to read across, so let's go with that, okay, so from two and a half years, we go up and across, now I make that to be uh, 6,000, let's say 6,400 pounds. They will accept a range of answers here. Um, so 6,400 pounds should be uh, safely within the range required.